Hello everybody, I am the Linkzilla, and welcome back to Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Uh, okay, when we last left off, we did some investigating, and we are on the trail of Cafe. All we need to do... Our, the mailman is our best lead, but it seems that his fiance might know something about him. So... Uh, we've elected to meet her sometime after midnight. At the same time, we also be better be prepared to help Romani. But until that time, I'm gonna do my damnedest to try and beat Stone Tower Temple. Well, beat is an interesting word. I'll try to get as much done as I can. I really wanted to be back here sooner, you guys, but friggin' loading up the car took longer than I thought, and then dropping the stuff off. It didn't take nearly as long, but I stuck around and spoke with the, the basically the person that I'm moving in with. We basically like hashed out some stuff. Then, ugh, the worst part is the fact that I needed to basically pick up some carpet fresh for the carpet of my old apartment so that when I vacuum this place, it'll be nice and clean smelling. <laughs> And unfortunately, my go-to stores just did not have it, so I ended up basically driving all over town looking for this stuff. Oh wait, I've already done that one, so... And I basically twisted my back while I was moving one of, my, one of the more heavier things. I hate this room. You remember how I said that Deku Scrubs can't touch lava or else they'll immediately die? Well... Oh, damn. <laughs> Fly, Deku boy. Oops. Well, at least I know what that thing down there is for. I thought that was for unlocking the door, but... Go down as a Goron. Ball. Now listen, Buster, I don't get why you think that you have any right to be timed. One, you're not green. Two, there was no ticking time to indicate that you were timed. Oh. Made it. Alright. Now... Huh. I don't think I ever noticed that there before. Well... Unfortunately, I don't have the equipment to do anything about it. I work smart, not hard, so why should I waste time and energy having to climb back up a ladder? 
when I can just teleport back to the door. I really hate my life sometimes. Yes! How the heck did I get all turned around? Yay, no more fairies here. Oh good, boss fight. Um Oh, this is an interesting room because not only is this the not only is this a mini boss fight, it's also well, we'll get to that. Familiar? It's a Garo Master. He holds on to his swords, but he'll lose track of you, so you can get him from behind. <laughs> I am the I know the Kai Ten Giri. And he's already done. Now watch this. To think I could be defeated, although my rival, you were spectacular. I shall take my bow, opening my heart and revealing my wisdom. If you shoot that which releases the sacred golden light into the blood-stained red emblem outside the temple, it shall rearrange things in which the earth is born in the heavens and the moon is born on the earth. Now watch this. A bomb. Do not forget these words. Die shall I shall, leaving no corpse. <laughs> that is the law of Ascaro. I mean, I know that they're technically already ghosts, but that guy literally just committed. S <laughs> anyway, it's time for the final weapon upgrade. And with this. All the keys to the temple are in my possession. The light arrow. <sighs> the blood-stained jewel outside the temple, eh? You know, I wonder, now that I have this arrow, I can't go back that way. Oh, great. Nijirons, or whatever they're called. It's a hip loop. But you can't first... But can't you first do something about that mask it's wearing? I wonder. Yes, yes, yes! Circumvention! My brain is better than everybody's! Yes. 
I don't have to come back here. Nya, 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 nya. Yeah. As you can see, we've almost been in every single room in the temple already, and yet we've left a lot of stuff behind. Why? Well, we'll get to that. And I'm pretty sure this door leads back to the entrance. Oh, nope. First we have to get through this guy. Wake up! And Igor... Hmm, Igor? No, it's pronounced Igor. Igor! Frederick! <laughs> Simply attacking it is no good. Basically, this thing is kind of like a mobile Beemos. And Goma. Two hits? Shameful. to stop now. I have until at least mi midnight. Dang it. Wrong one again? I, I need to friggin... Right, so you come over this way, you see that gem, you shoot at it with a light arrow. It's a switch. What the fuck? How does Link even get out of that? Well, at least now the pathway is open. The temple has literally turned upside down. In fact, the entire world is technically upside down. Long way up. A short way down. But look at this. These weird monkey blocks that we've been rolling on. On the, the underside has the Triforce. I wonder if they're not monkeys. Maybe they maybe they're supposed to be the giants. Stone Tower Temple inverted. Oh, look at that. Everything is a disgusting piss color. We need to get there. This is basically how this uh, level gets tricky. This is the innovation that shakes things up and separates it from other temples. Oh, a block, huh? 
Smile for the sun. Bubbles. Oh. Well, now that we've gotten this room unlocked, we can start getting all that, all the treasure that we have left behind. What the? I didn't. The hell? <laughs> oh yeah, it's a blue one. Okay, so I attacked him from behind. Do you really have to get rid of the shell? The shield? I mean, if you attack a Triceratops from behind, that big frilled sh shield on its head isn't going to help it. It can only help- it can only defend from an, on an attack coming f onward. Let's shed a little more light on the situation. Oh, come on. I hate it when the game does that. Because now I'm going to have to come back here. I need a key. That ought to do it. Right, let's go harass some chews. It's almost 11. Get the bunny hood. You cannot miss that meeting with the pretty lady in the kitchen. in this room before, but as you can see... Now you might think that that would basically be a good opportunity to go back out and... Because it flipped the temple, to go back out into the last room and... But as you can see, the room, the rest of the temple is still reversed. It clearly only works for this room. I need to find some magic, and fast. Ha <laughs> <laughs> 
Aw, oh, dang it. I just now realized I forgot to do something. Such is me. Maybe just a little bit of magic? Whatever that is, I will take it. Move! Well, I'm all out of options. The good news is, is that getting into the temple will be easier. Because you don't need to flip the world back right side up. Ugh, my brain is scrambled eggs right now. I'd like my brain with a side of toast, please. They ain't gonna know what hit him. Blah, 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 I really wanted to see the cutscene that has this guy trying to get his reservation, the one that I took. I can't believe I forgot about it. The wind has gotten damp, Goro. Tomorrow is rain, Goro, Goro, Goro. Effectively, Goro is basically this guy's speech impediment, and because Anju didn't recognize the name Link Goro, Barton, hit me up. <laughs> and now that I have the key to the inn, well, the inn closes its doors at 8.30, but I have a key. She's going to the kitchen. Anju. I am sorry to trouble you late at night. It's about him. Cafe. I received a letter from him. Strange, isn't it? Getting a letter from a missing person? Not all that strange at all. But there's absolutely no mistaking. It's from him. It's clear to me. Please. Here is my letter. Please put this in a post box. The thing about it is, you might think that this is ultimately, like, just uh, a bit confusing, considering that she could just as easily put this letter in a post box herself, but she's giving it to Link because it's the clue that he needs. Effectively, what she says next. When this is delivered, when he receives my letter, you should be able to meet him. She's basically telling Link to trail the letter. The letter will lead him to Café. Well, more or less, the red cap will lead him to cafe, but still. Please tell him that Anju is waiting for him. And please, after you've seen him, tell me how he looked. I'm scared. I can't go. Can I ask this of you? Thank you very much. Your given letter to cafe. Quick, deliver it for her. Take it to a mailbox. 
You made an important promise. Please mail it immediately in the morning. Hey, I thought I was Batman in this situation. But, we got a letter to Cafe. But, I couldn't leave the Stockpot Inn, nor could I finish this game without adding one more important person to my Bomber's Notebook. Oh! B -b -b paper please! Sorry, pal. Not this time. Who? Well, that person was added to your notebook. Yep, they get added, so... <laughs> yep, and because I've already helped him, he's basically been added to the notebook, and... Ah, oh, crap, I forgot to go back and re-meet with Dotor. That's good. That's bad. A good thing that I remembered because when the morning comes, I want one specific person to be the final person I add to this book. Let's see. It's after midnight, and I have to help Romani at two. Should I br should I risk it? Can I go back to Stone Tower Temple? This song's not even gonna work in here. Why did I even bother? Oh, it does. Bullseye. Man, so this is a story all about how my life got flipped, turned upside down, and I'm wearing bunny ears. And I'd like to take a minute, just sit right there, and I'll explain to you all why I'm wearing bunny ears. I mean, it's obvious that I won't be able to complete Stone Tower Temple tonight, but... <laughs> it's only pain, Link. It's only lava. Shake it off. It would be great if this room affected the entire temple, but I guess that would be too easy. Just to think, if I had made it into this room... Alright, so... This room is a block puzzle. You gotta get this block into the square hole that's over in that corner. I was standing on the block. Oh yeah, the block is on this side now. The only problem is that I have with it is that the game is literally gonna strong arm me into into doing the whole reverse thing twice. 
It would be cool if I could get it to where it would land right in the spot, but I don't think I can push it far enough. Ah, oh, great. They're already back. Do you mind? I'm busy here. Friggin <laughs> this is a fire whiz robe, and I noticed the last time that I played this. This seems to be effective. I don't know why the mini boss music isn't playing. Lava. You guys ever played the floor as lava? Well, I get to play the ceiling as lava. Ow! <laughs> Goodbye. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up! How many was that? Twelve? Yep, three more. This is the only place in the game where you see normal pose. I'm not gonna panic, I've got until... 2.30. It'll only take me like a few seconds to scurry on into... Wait. I should really go back and do this room. Death Armos, a temple guard. Look at that red mark on its chest. I know you've seen it mean something like that before. Wait, no, not the hook shot. Now you turn this guy upside down, then you get underneath him. He you're not supposed to turn right back up. have to leave.
I can't remember. The last time I did this, did I have time protection on or off? And I'm not t referring to the, the time that we don't speak about. Hang on, Romani. All right, you fiends, come and get it. I'm turning it off just to basically not only speed this up, but also add a little bit of challenge because before long, you bas this basically just becomes shooting like the same one in the same spot over and over and over again. This bunny is too fast for you. Though it can be a bit unnerving to see how close they can sometimes get. Let's send you back. Now for wrath! Now for ruin! And the sun rises! Don't you get over that fence. That guy got lucky. Run, you cowards, run! Right, well, let's get back to work. <sighs> to the Stone Tower! First things first, I'm going to go in there and I'm going to get that chest. Thirteen. You know, considering that Macau's guitar is made out of a fish skeleton, I really do think he should be able to use it underwater. Especially given that sound is clearly traveling underwater right now. Pretty sure that if I were to go in there, those pots would attack me. Don't ask me how that... How, how I know that, I just do. Actually, I'm gonna save that room for last. First, I'm gonna do what I probably should have done a while ago and do this one, but I knew that I wouldn't have time for it, so... Oh, I forgot. There's still more. 
Right. Here's one of the reasons why I really wa couldn't wait to get the, the light arrows. Because now that there are blue bubbles flying around... They drop 50 rupees when killed. These guys are my new cash crop. And now time for the... For one of the final mini-bosses of the game, and quite frankly, one of the more intense ones. This, to me, is basically proof positive that this game is about Link overcoming death, because the final oh, mini-boss is... Death itself. The Grim Reaper. Terrifying, isn't it? Go, mess. There'll be no end to it if you can't get the... Those bats away from it. Does that shed shed any light on the situation? I wonder. I did see a video once recently where Well, I did manage to hit it, but then he hit me. Well, anyways, if it's fairly obvious what you're supposed to do... Try that again. Dang it, I could have sworn that that would, that would actually hit. <laughs> its scythe had a style child skull on it. And that's that. Good fight. It's the last boss key. Now I gotta get back out there. Pop the hood. You see that? The sun is literally down there. The sun was shining on the sea, shining with all his might. He did his very best to make the billows smooth and bright. And this was all because it was... The middle of the night. Might as well do this. That'll give me even more incentive to go back and flip this thing on its head. You are too stupid for this world. Goodbye. Let's go get that fairy.
I've got it! Let's change a light bulb! <laughs> One strike kill. Don't worry, I'll find someone who cares about you. Anyway. It's already past nine o'clock. I gotta make sure that he picks us up on his rounds. Here he comes. Which means that the first mailbox he should stop by should be... This one. Deposit mail here. shall be delivered this afternoon. You sent the letter! You can effectively do that at any time, just make sure that you make you do it, like, sometime before the mail gets picked up. Got it. And now all I have to do is wait. To the mayor's office. Oh, wrong way. Right. Got Mayor Dotor. I've basically got a quarter of the day. But right now, I gotta get back. I'm gonna finish that temple. And what better time than during a thunderstorm? Because the thunder should disguise it. The earth is gonna shake. That's what happens when the giants go to battle. Giants. Or should I say, kaiju. Unless I basically give myself, like, a few hours to play tomorrow, which I probably shouldn't do, this sh might be the last time that I'll record in this apartment. Because at the time of this video, tomorrow is the day that I am moving out. Granted, it's two days before the deadline, but I just don't want to basically, like, uh... I just basically want to get it out of the way, you know what I'm saying? I am gonna miss this place, though. 
Although I think that if any wor if any Zelda world actually existed, apart from the Ocarina of Time Hyrule, a place where I would consider living would be Termina. Because Termina just, uh, when it's peaceful, it's so quaint. Wait, why is the sun shining here? Isn't it supposed to be thundering? They didn't think about that. We're about to get wet. I mean, unless there's a point to killing that Beemos, which I don't think that there is. Other than I'm a homicidal lunatic. I don't think that I can actually do this. I think I'm gonna have to go through the puzzle. Cause this is like always one of the hardest things, jumping up into that shore with a Zora jump. Especially because this game always has this control glitch to where you basically, Zora Link just doesn't take off if you hold it down. He always basically like does it twice. Oh wait. Could have made that if I didn't. Hey guys, how many buttons do you think that this puzzle needs? Yes. Look, we just gave him a song that basically does this mechanic of holding down buttons. I mean, one song wakes sleeping things up, another song puts big things to sleep. The other song basically revives the lost voice and thus broken spirit of a tragically... of a, of a mother going through a tragedy. This song basically allows you to hold buttons down. My tongue feels weird. Feels like it's been stung. Getting stung on the tongue. I wish there was a better way to kill Beemos. They're just so obtrusive. This will be our final stray fairy. Quick. I'm just now realizing that I probably won't be able to friggin' get the hook shot in order to get that chest from the entrance, even when I am upside down. Oh no, I forgot. Well, I can, at least I can show you guys something. You put on, you put on the Gibdo mask, and you come up here. Bring them! Those inside, our friends, bring them! Yeah, I'm not gonna basically complete this quest. Go away, man! I'm not going to complete this area without basically getting this river back up, because you can't go back and do this after you beat Stone Tower Temple. Let's see, um... And now I go collect my reward. I'll teach those pesky Gibdos to want friends. Seriously. 
I would make a social distancing joke, but right now I'm just kind of put out. And this one is all Link. The final great fairy. She's a Super Saiyan 3! Oh, compassionate young one, I am the Great Fairy of Kindness. Thank you for returning my broken and shattered body to normal. As thanks, I grant you the Fairy Sword. The Great Fairy Sword. With black roses etched into it, the Great Fairy Sword is the most powerful of all blades. <laughs> it's strong, all right. Probably about as strong as the Begoron Sword. But there is one that is more powerful. A blade that rises above all others. Come see me when you are overcome with weariness. She doesn't give you an ability, she literally gives you a weapon. That little good little do us. Back to the top of the tower. <laughs> spatula, spatula, port and starboard att attachments. <laughs> I'll never be able to make it from here. I need to be higher. Good girl, Tattle. Yeah! Spider Link, Spider Link. Linkzilla could really use a drink, but he's had too much, <laughs> hasn't he? Cause he really has to pee. Look out! Here comes the Spider Link. See what I mean about them being buff Beemos? And now for one of the final masks of the game. Surprise that this didn't end up being the final mask that I get, but... I mean, don't get me wrong. I mean, one of the final masks. I mean... I still have, like, three other masks that I need to get. Of course, uh, you can only get those three masks on the final day, so... This mask. Probably one of the most important and powerful masks ever. The Giant's Mask. Within this mask lies the might of a giant, but can you use its power anywhere? Alright. We're back in the room where we f we're heading... Okay, uh, I need the hook shot. Come on and hook me with your best shot. Get me with your hook shot. We're heading back into the room where we fought the ma the Garo Master. Might as well have this equipped. You see the the place where the Garo came from. It's now where the boss is. A portal to another world. We're in the sky. The desert. Holy crap, look at the size of that thing. And there's another one! Giant masked insect, twin mold. How the heck am I gonna fight something like that? Look at, look, look at the scale! Well, at a time like this, there's only one thing to say. It's Linkzilla time. <laughs> Kaiju battle! <laughs> Tail is obviously the weak point. The only problem is, is that this battle can sometimes get tedious. 
because Tattle is so small, she can't lock onto the onto their weak points for you, which include the head and the tail. Looks like the blue one's gonna get it first. Or maybe. The thing about the giant's mask is that this is the only room that you can use it in. It also uses up magic, so it's a good idea to basically get to Chateau Romani beforehand. Die already! Thank you. Now I gotta get the other one. Thinking about what the, the last giant said to us. Save our friend. And the, old, and the story that the old woman told us. Imp. And dead. Now I gotta get back to town. But I'm not leaving here without my prizes. The only problem is, you can't just step into the portal as a giant and shri suddenly shrink back down to size. You saw that! It moved laterally! I think time st stopped. You've seized Twin Mold's remains. I guess the giant was trapped in the blue one? Well, we've helped all of you. That's all we can do. C-L-L-U-S. Call us. That's what they're saying. Without being told, we understand. So now you'll help us out in, the, in, in exchange? We'll call you from atop the clock tower. So do something about him, all right? What? Their voices sound sad. You don't want to? F O R G I V E eight Y O U R F R I E N D Forgive your friend. Forgive our friend? What do you mean by forgive? Huh? What friend? I would it would have been more powerful if they just said forgive him. This scene would probably look better at night. Oh. Those are the spirits that linger here. They're free. veil over the sky has lifted. I gotta get back to town. If I'm hurry, I might- if I hurry, I might be able to catch him. It's not 1.30 yet, is it? Is there Balm and Gilead? It's not too late. I hear him. He's moving away. It's 
locked? Oh, please don't tell me I've missed it. Although I still don't think I ever figured out what this guy does in the dead of night. It's night of the second day, right? I think I get it. This guy knows that somebody has to be following him. So he's moving around in a way to prevent from being followed. Wait a second, what am I doing? I beat the temple, so now... Listen guys, I need a break, so... I'm basically gonna call it quits for this episode right here, so... Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like it and share it with your friends. If you wanna keep up to date, with more Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Majora's Mask coming at you in the future, then be sure to smash that subscribe button and ring that bell for notifications. And as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Later.